Welcome viewers to TV Box Stop. On today's video, I have a demonstration on how to upgrade the firmware of the Magic CN6 Max TV Box. This is to fix the issue where some users are having difficulty entering their Google account information. To upgrade the box there are two methods. The SD card method, and the USB OTG method. In this video I will show the SD card method as it is the easier of the two. So after the break, I will do a step-by-step -step demonstration on how to complete this process, so stay tuned, because that's coming up next. Welcome back. To successfully complete this process, you would need the following things. A Magic CN6 Max TV box. One micro SD card and standard adapter. The latest N6 Max firmware. The latest Rockship Create Upgrade Disk Tool Program. A program called Mini Tool Partition Wizard. And a PC or laptop. Links to download the firmware, the disk tool, and the mini partition tool can be found in the description area below this video. And now let's begin. Complete the following steps. Step 1. Download the firmware and the SD card tool onto your PC into a separate folder. Step 2. Unzip the files into its current folder by simply right-clicking on the file and selecting Extract here. If using the WinZip program, select Extract All. Once this is done, you should have two folders. A folder containing the firmware in the form of an image file, and a folder containing the Rockchip disk creation tool. Step 3. Download and install the mini partition tool on your computer. Step 4. Insert the SD card onto your PC or laptop. For those PCs that come with regular size SD slots, use an adapter to complete this step. Step 5. Open the Rockchip Disk Creation tool by using the right-click mouse button and select Run as Administrator. You will then receive a Windows prompt message asking you if to allow the program to run, select Yes and the program will open. In the main panel of the program you will see four choices. In the first choice, click the drop-down arrow and select the SD card drive on your computer. It will state that it is an SD reader and it will also show the size of the SD card. In the second choice, make sure that upgrade firmware is the only option selected. In the third choice, click on the firmware button and browse to the folder where you unzip the firmware image and select it. And in the fourth choice you simply click create and allow the process to finish. If you receive an error message, it means that the program cannot format the SD card and you would have to format the card and run the program again. To format an SD card, simply right click on the drive and click format. If that doesn't work, use the mini partition tool to delete the partition and then format it again.
sometimes the SD card needs rebuilding the MBR to get it working again. Step 6. Once the writing process on the SD card is completed, eject the SD card from your computer by right-clicking on the drive and clicking Eject. This is to ensure that there is no corrupted data before using the card on the TV box. Step 7. Remove the power adapter from the N6 Max and insert the SD card. You should hear a clicking sound as you insert the card indicating that it is locked in place. Once the card is inserted properly, plug in the power adapter and allow the flash process to begin. There is no pressing of the reset button involved in this process. Step 8. The final step is to remove the SD card when the flash process prompts you to do so. Once removed the box will automatically continue its final flashing process. Once completed, the box will reboot and take you to the launcher. Step 9. Navigate to the settings area and check the build information to verify that the process was successful. Well folks, there you have it. This was a step-by-step -step demonstration on how to upgrade the Magic CN6 Max TV box which fixes the Google account login issue. Thanks for watching, remember to like this video, share it with friends, and subscribe to this channel for more TV box stop videos.